Greetings, hello, and welcome everybody. Death's Kobar here with you today. And today we're making a video on how to basically make a windowed mode, make a game windowed mode if it's not already able to be windowed mode. If, uh, you know, you've tried the different shortcuts and thing, shortcut extensions. Or you've tried putting it in on the Steam to the dash windowed or dash SW and it didn't work. If you, there is no way to window it in the game, there is a way to get this done. And I'm doing this because a friend was having some trouble streaming last night trying to get a game into windowed mode and could not get it. And so she decided to go to a different game until she could figure this out. So... What you do is you download this called DXWND, DXWind, and it's a windowed mode managing program, basically. Um, so I found this on the Oddworld forums. Uh, Oddworld is Abe's Odyssey is actually the game that she was having trouble with, so I checked the Oddworld forums, and this is what they recommended. I've actually got the game on Steam also, which is what made it easy for me to be able to diagnose the issue and fix it. So what you want to do is you want to get the XWind open and then you want to hit configure. Alright, so from here, you're no, you, it's not usually going to go straight to there, and let me delete this just for sake of playing here, uh, playing around with stuff here. So you're going to Go to local disk C to find this, program files, x86, you're going to find your Steam, which should be somewhere right around here. Go to Steam, then you want to go from Steam to Steam Apps, common, and then find the game you want. Oddworld Apes Odyssey is what we're looking for, and then you want to find the .exe. From here you can configure your .exe to what you want. Now, it's naturally got this at zero on both of these, and there is a reason for that. And on Ibs Odyssey, I highly suggest you keep it on zero. There is a glitch with the system because some games weren't made to be full screen to begin with, and how they are made work in a full screen how they're made to run in full screen and stuff will mess up with this trying to make them windowed mode and it'll freak some stuff out on your computer and <laughs> as far as like visual stuff um so you'll have like half this screen with the game here and then half of it not it's it's weird looking so from there after configuring you hit run and you can run it here and just run it runs this little command line there, and then you'll have the game running. And then from there, you, if, you know, everything looks good and you like how it is, you can hit create shortcut, and then you can click on the .exe and make a shortcut, name it, and put it where you want so you can easily get to this. Now the shortcut will run it in the windowed mode, actually, and not it's not just a regular shortcut, it is a windowed mode shortcut using this. Now this does work on other things, so, you know, you can try this on other games if you need to. So I hope this helps, guys. Uh, I really do. Um, I haven't really messed around with this enough to know how it all works. You know, I just play... I just kind of figured it all out on my own as I went and figured that might work. Alright, so, basically, yeah. I hope this helps. Anyone who needs help using this program, please put comments down in the, the description below. <laughs> uh... I mean, not the, the description. Comments down below, below the description. I'll put stuff in the description below. Sorry. Uh, not really thinking right now. My mouth's hurting a bit. I'm sorry I'm not using my webcam. 
lately, guys. Uh, getting a new one and also some other new stuff and basically waiting till everything comes in before I set anything up because it's all going to go in at once. Um. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, share, and subscribe. If you need any help, just contact me, put a comment, whatever. Feel free to contact me on Twitter. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media. And as always, to all you nerds out there, to all you gamers, and to all you geeks, keep doing what you do. This is Death's Crowbar signing out.